Hello children. Well, it's a very special day today. It's called Remembrance Sunday. How good are you remembering things? Maybe you need reminders to help you remember important things. Well, I've got a little reminder here. Well, I've got two in fact. Can you see what they are? They're two very small coins. And those two small coins remind me of a thing that happened in the Bible. Something that Jesus noticed. He, he noticed a poor widow, and she put two tiny coins, they're called mites, they were, two tiny coins into the collection box in the temple, like our church in a way. Uh, all the other people were putting lots of money in, and ooh, some were putting great big notes, lots and lots of money. And this poor woman, she was a widow, she, her husband had died, and she had so little. And Jesus said, do you know, she said, he said to his disciples, do you know, that woman gave more than all those people putting all that money into the collection box. Do you know why? Well, it's because she gave everything she had. That was all she had. She gave everything she had. I'm going to show you a picture now. Can you see what it is? It's a picture of a field of poppies and people wear poppies on Remembrance Sunday and that's to remind them about something a little bit like what we just talked about. The poppies remind us of people who gave everything. They gave their lives. Men and women fighting in battles in the war who died and gave their lives so that we could have our freedom, so that we could have our way of life. And that was the price that many, many had to pay. And so on Remembrance Sunday, we specially remember those soldiers and sailors and airmen, uh, and their women as well, who gave their lives in the service of their country so that we could have our freedom. And you know, there's something else that we need to use as a reminder, and that's the cross. When we think about the cross, that reminds us about the Lord Jesus. And we need to remember him every day of our lives, don't we? Not just on a special occasion, because he gave his all. He gave everything he had. He gave his life. He shed his blood. And of course, his blood is the colour of poppies, isn't it? And the poppies remind us of the blood that was shed by all those people in the armed forces, but also the blood of Christ, which was shed on the cross so that we could be saved. Remember that widow who gave everything? She gave everything she had, and, and we should give everything we have because of what the Lord Jesus has done for us when he gave himself for us. And we should also remember all those people who gave everything they had so that we could have our freedom. Let's just say a prayer together. Let's pray. Heavenly Father, we want to thank you on this special Remembrance Sunday for all those people, many thousands of people who died in the wars and in conflicts since the, since the world wars in order to help us have our freedom and keep living the way that we live. And we thank you for them. We remember them. We remember their families who will be grieving over them on this day. And we pray that you'll be with them and that you'll comfort them. And we thank you even more than that for the wonderful sacrifice that the Lord Jesus Christ made when he died on the cross so that we could be free from our sin. And so we thank you for him. We want to remember him. Help us to remember him every day of our lives to help us to give ourselves for him who gave himself for us, we ask. In Jesus' name, Amen. When I stop and look at the starry sky Or hear all the birds as they call up high When I smell sea salt in the sand I'm enjoying the works of your hand 
All my senses tell me the maker must be great. All the world is singing, asking us to join in. Creation shouts it, God is Lord of all. Everywhere you go, you can always hear it call. Pad is played for all the world to see. A masterpiece from the King of Eternity. When I stop and look at a human face, or hear that we made it up into space, when I learn what the body does. I'm enjoying the work of your love. All my senses tell me our Maker must be great. All creation singing, helping us to join in. Creation shouts it, God is Lord of all. Everywhere you go, you can always hear it call. Pad is played for all the world to see. A masterpiece from the King of Eternity. I quite like what he's done with it, actually. Mm, it's amazing. Things new again.